What's up everyone, it's Chris Garcia, <clears throat> Garcia's Pepper Farms. Um, today I'm going to be uh, mixing up some um, seed starting mix. And um, I got this recipe from um, Nunez at NPG. So I'm going to try his method out. It seems promising, hopefully, you know. I'm sure he, I'm pretty sure he is because he's very good about um, what he's doing. So um, this is the stuff I'm going to be using. Um, this is what I have so far. I mean, this is what I, what I could pick up right now. That's in my budget. So this was about like six bucks right here. Okay. And this was about another six bucks right here. I showed, um, pictures on the, um, Pepper's Lovers Committee. And, um, these are the little trays that I'm going to be filling in with. I got a set of four, a set of four trays, <clears throat> and what's cool about these trays is they come with a little dome to put on top, which was, which I thought was pretty neat, and it also comes with a bottom tray to put um, nutrients, water, you know, to... um. To bottom feed bottom water which is i think it's the best way to do so just you know put your ceilings in put that on top put a heating mat under if you guys have a heating mat and um that's that's about it and i got these trays for a few bucks at um i don't know if you guys are familiar with the website geek so uh I got these from Geek for like I, I think it was like three bucks, two bucks okay. for a set of four. So back to my mix right here. Okay. Has a little bit of perlite, and um, this is um, this is sphagnum peat moss. That's in this um, soil right here, and using some. Earthworm castings, some bio life right here, great stuff, and some azomite. So, it's pretty windy up here, so um, I'm gonna try my best. I got stuff blowing all everywhere right now, so um, I'm gonna try my best and uh, mix all this up. So, um, all right, sorry guys got cut off um so what's next is my black gold earthworm castings by sun grow i already mixed in some um i mean i already put in some um that miracle girl that i just showed you guys i only have a half a cup a scoop i don't know if you guys can see it but it's a half a cup so i guess two of these will be equal to a cup so I put six cups equally of um, that potting mix. So I'm gonna put um, six cups of this worm castings in here. So let's see how this stuff looks like. Oh man, look at that. Nice and rich. Let's see the texture. Oh yeah, you got a little bit of wood chips in there. But as far as the way it feels, it feels fluffy. <laughs> like Gabriel Iglesias feels fluffy. So I'm going to add um, six cups of this. So, alrighty, here we go. So, um, it's going to be boring just recording me pouring six cups of this stuff so i'm gonna stop the video and then i'm gonna um do the next step right now so i'm just gonna go ahead and stop it right here and i'll show you guys the next step all right so i'm back with a half a tablespoon so i'm gonna be um pouring some azomite 
this is how the azomite looks like if the camera could catch it if not it's just um little rock dust particles yeah oh there it goes yeah it's just little rock dust particles it's very fine powder so i'm just gonna put four of these in here it'll equal to one tablespoon so that's three yeah this stuff is by um down to earth all organic so all organic in here so that's that and the next is gonna be the bio life this soil nice and rich so I'm gonna add some of the bio life gotta take it out the package right here so this stuff's gonna be great all right so this is how this looks like All that good stuff in there. So I'm gonna be mixing up four of these little scoops. That's two. This is three. And four. All right, so just gonna go in with my hand and just mix all this good stuff up. So by doing this, all this richness is gonna be good for the um, seed starting. So as your seeds sprout, they're gonna have some richness to it already. It'll be good for the root, root systems, really good stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix this up and then go inside because it's way too windy out here. And um, put this soil on the trays. All right, so here's the next step. So what I'm gonna do here is just pour the, the richness in here. I'm gonna get organized right here. Oh, I'm gonna use these um, little red parted Dixie cups for labels. Just stick it right in the side right here. I'll show you guys right now. Just wanted to show you guys what I have going on right here. So that's the soil. Just pour it in gently. Well, not gently, you gotta try and, you know, just pour it all in. But, um, I have it in another, um, bigger tray right here, so I won't make that much of a mess. If not, the wife would destroy me. So, she's gonna pour, she's so gonna get some chunks like this, just tear it all up right there. Just. So just pour all this in here evenly. Hello? So Hello? it's alright if you guys get it on the sides or you know just like that. If you see any big wood chips, just take it out. Uh yeah, what was it again? No need to have them in here. So, yeah, just fill it up. Try to fill it out evenly. And just as you go on, just go and fill everything up nicely. Get a little bit. I need a little bit right here. Oh, I got some big chunks right here. A big wood chip right there. So, that's it. Make sure your soil is moist when you do this part. So yeah, there, I'm gonna finish 
find this rest right here. All right. So there we go. And then I'm off to the next one. And so on and so on. All right. So I basically just watered this soil down nice and good. And I'm just going to take some of these reaper seeds right here. Chocolate reapers. Let's drop them in. I'll drop two. And one right there. One right there. I need to make another label for that. And then I'm basically just going to put these labels just along the back side of this. Of the little cell right here. Just like this. Just put it. Right there, and there you go. That's how I'm going to know where everything is at. And if I need to cut the labels, which is I think I'm pretty sure I'll be good on them. Just like that. Got plastic bottles everywhere. So there you go. That's how it is. And... Gonna take this out. So I'm just gonna basically just get my finger, dig them in, get this one, dig them in, dig it in. Not too deep though, not too deep. Dig it in. Uh oh, that one's. Alright, and just pour the soil over. Like so. And that's it. Okay. Or, if that didn't go down properly, just get a little bit of the soil right here. Just fill up the cell. up again and there you go so that's what I'm gonna do to the rest of these cells label with um, labels made with this red Dixie cup and that's about it guys all right so I would like to thank all of you guys for watching my video on how I gonna start my uh, seedlings for 2018 so that's that's my process that's what i'm gonna go with and hopefully you guys enjoyed that video and stay tuned for some updates uh hopefully they're gonna be some great updates but that's all for this week thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my videos and god bless you guys